Good day! Thank you for joining me for another episode of Atari 8-Bit Gameplay. Why am I overloading the sound channel here? Maybe I need to crank the music down a smidge. Um, alright. Oh, yeah, I'm jumping into the... Overloading the microphone here, that's weird. Crank that down a, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit more. Okay, I don't want to be blowing it out. Hopefully that doesn't sound terrible. Okay, what have we got here? Bombino it is called. Uh, I don't know anything about this other than the name and the... We've got a... I'm gonna call it a bomber. It looks more like a fighter. But it looks like it's carrying bombs under its wings. And we see bombs falling and we see a house. So, based on the title screen, we bomb houses from fighter jets. Let's, uh, let's see. Ooh, oh, hey, cool. But glitchy. I wonder if this is a PAL game. Bombino, you know what? I'm gonna say it probably is. So let us find the right setting. Here we go. And reset this, and... Oh, that's the previous video I made. That was weird. Why did that stay? Bombino. Here we go. Oh, sound. the music is a lot less frenetic, so that's... That seems likely that this is the correct... Uh, there we go. No more glitchiness. What do you do? Oh, I picked up bombs. Bombino. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, I haven't bombed anything. Fuel and score. Okay. Nope. Mm, did I get some? Oh, I did. Hey, hey. There we go. Uh, now what do I get points for? Houses, for sure. What about these hill things? Nope. Planes? Nope. No. What about the blue planes? Graves? No. Or churches, maybe? Do I bomb churches? That doesn't seem reasonable. getting points for anything. Except houses. Nope, not those. Uh, hill things? No. Little face guys? No. Oh, I don't know. I'm out of bombs. Does this just go... Oh no, there's fuel. Okay. Uh, so that's bombs. Can you get fuel? One wonders. That didn't give me point. None of these things give me points. What the heck? Just bomb. Just houses, I guess. The bombino signs get you points. Can you get more fuel is my next question. Looks like the answer to that is no. Bombino signs don't get you any points. Nothing gets you any dang points except for houses. Which kind of lines up, I guess, with the title screen. Yeah, okay, so bomb the houses. Bomb the houses, and you can't get more fuel? Unless you need to bomb some number of houses in order to get to the end of the level, maybe? Feels like those little alien-looking guys should give you points. I'm good at missing. I'm excellent at missing the uh, houses. I 
wonder how close you ha how accurately you have to tag them to get a point or five points I should say oh I have no more bombs bombino let's try the edge uh, if I could actually hit one, hit the edge I think that got me points did it yes okay so you don't have to hit them dead on So is this a get as many points as you can before the fuel runs out sort of a game? Feels like it is. Did I get that little alien looking dude? I don't think I did. Almost out of fuel. <clears throat> so, whoa, whoa. Did you enjoy bombing? Start for a new game. Coded by Zdenda, music by Poison. So music, or, yeah, Poison. Music on the title screen. That, that color cycling is a little frantic for my taste, but not terrible, I guess. Just startled me at first. The, the the top of the, the top half start for a new game okay <clears throat> well mr zdenda zubik zenda zdenda i think something like that uh, he is a prolific coder these days releasing new things i think this is a new ish game if i'm not mistaken okay so the first thing is to pick up some bombs and then start bombing houses, I guess. The hills, just to be, oh, I, I gotta hit a hill to find out for sure. The hills, yeah, the hills don't get you any points. The hills do not get you any points. What about those dudes? Nope, nothing. So just the houses. If I could hit them, it would actually improve my score quite a bit. More bombs needed, please. There we go. So I'm thinking that the object generation is basically random because that's sure what it looks like. I should have picked up those bombs when I had the chance. Blue, you get blue objects and yellow objects and houses and that is the story. The end. And I am not such a good shot, although getting better, maybe. Maybe. Oops, that was not great. Oh, why did I not pick up bombs, you say? An excellent question. You really have to, I think, maximize your bomb picking up in order to maximize your score, I think, on this game. It purely seems to be a timed exercise here. So get your best score in the amount of time that you have available, the amount of fuel that you have. So is this a good game? It's not bad. I have played a hell of a lot worse, let me tell you. Simple concept, decently executed. There we go, actually hit a few that time. You can only bomb so quickly, so if they're right back to back, you just, you can't release your bombs fast enough. How am I doing? 320? I wonder if I can get to 500. The plane noise is basic and gets a little tedious. In my ear. 
425. I feel like 500 is within my grasp. Especially since my aim seems to be improving a bit here. A bit. I didn't say I was perfect at it, I just said I was improving a bit. Cut me some slack, man. Oh, hey, I'm over 500. That makes me happy. More bombs, please. Do I have time for 600? Maybe. If I don't miss. Oh yeah, 600. 600 is mine. 40, 40, 37 fuel units remaining. More bombs needed. Nope, nope. Ah, you buggers. More houses needed now. Done. No high score table. Did you enjoy bombing? I'm not sure what my score was. 600 and something. Would would been kind of nice if that like uh your the high score is blah. Was there a high score display? I'm not gonna play. No, there isn't. Okay, cool. Cool little game. Not bad at all. Fun for fun for a few minutes. Uh, probably probably good for a younger crowd. A little more entertaining for someone that's younger. I would expect. And uh, definitely worth a look. But that is going to do it for my look at Bombino. So uh, you take good care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. Bye.